boom. What's up, Money Geeks? Mr. V here. Welcome to another video. So in this one, we are just going to have a conversation and uh, me answering a question that a lot of you guys um, have been asking about investing strategy. Um, how do you find the stocks that you invest in? Um, and so I just want to make sure that I give you guys kind of like an uh, overview as to the way I approach investing. So we'll cover that in today's video. But before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. If that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. So when it comes to investing, again, this is investing. This is not trading. Uh, when it comes to investing, uh, this is so long term. You're talking three, four, five years, 10 years uh, where you put your money and just let it sit or put your money to work and then watch it after over the years and watch it grow. So uh, for those of you guys that are really looking into investing, my strategy, uh, which I kind of tweaked a little bit because um, I think the um, the last five or six years, I started to move things in a different direction. I used to be the traditional investor where I would say, hey, I want to buy blue chip companies and I just hang on to them, which I still do. I have those. But and then I was like, yeah, but at that rate, my account is not going to grow uh, at the speed that I want. So what did I do? I switched from not just blue chips, but also uh, a portion of my overall uh, investment was actually in disruptive technology. And again, this is not my idea from the ground up. I actually, um, when I started following Kathy Wood and I see what she was doing, um, I'm not, I, I was like, yeah, I'm not going to copy exactly what you are doing in terms of like buying the exact same companies you're buying. Because by the time Kathy Wood buys that company, I bet you the company is already Already out there uh, and making some noise so uh, you're probably gonna be paying premium compared to where she got in so I, I'm gonna do my own research um, I'm gonna pick my industries and I like and I'm gonna start looking for companies in that space and so my idea was disruptive in the sense like hey if I take a company say or if I take an industry excuse me let's say for instance um, the um, auto industry we are headed to what, um, you know, electric vehicles, whether you like it or not, that's the direction that we're going because even all the fossil fuel companies are pledging to go electric. So uh, do I have to sit there and wait until they go electric before you invest? No, you find companies that are in that space. And the trick is um, if you miss out on, say, Tesla, most people just sit there and just fold their hands like, oh, I missed out on Tesla. You start looking for the next one. Who is going to be the next Tesla? Tesla has done your thing. But as a matter of fact, there's another company that's going to come in and do something that's going to be a little bit different from Tesla. That's going to put them on the map. So um, in this case, I'm talking about Lucid Models. For those of you guys that have been following my channel, you guys know I like Lucid. But again, I'm just using that as an example here. So I look at Lucid. They're building uh, a luxury brand uh, just like your Porsche, like, you know, your Ferraris. Um, Lucy is building, presenting himself as electric, but luxury. So you start looking at industries like that. And then uh, for another company that I really like or disruptive that I see is the X-ray industry, because the X-ray industry has been very, very a cake for a long time. So this company called Nano X is actually trying to change that into so the building a new system that makes, um, you know, getting x-rays a lot easier, make it global where you can take x-rays in South America and put it in the cloud and a doctor here in the United States can reference those. Somebody can take x-rays out in Africa, put them in the cloud and somebody here in the United States can look at the x-rays and be able to make recommendations, which I think is good. So I like Nano X because of where they're going. So um, just to give you guys those simple examples, from that perspective, I look at these companies and then I put money in, in, in them. And again, the good thing about this is you go in low. Um, the downside is you can invest a thousand dollars. The downside is you can lose half of that or you can lose uh, less, uh, three quarters of that money. But the, the upside is you can 10x that money. You can 20x that $1,000 if you got in at the right time. So the trick is finding those companies. You're going to spend a lot of hours um, finding the companies. It's not just going to come to you. You have to do the work. And I bet you by the time the companies get on the map, 
they are already selling at premium. So again, I've mentioned companies here on the channel. I've talked about Meta Material. I told you guys this one from the get go. Um, I, we've talked about Cooler Technology. I've told you guys that these companies that are doing things that are different. I like SoFi. They're doing things that are a little bit different than your traditional uh, uh, technology is doing today. So let's take a step back. Look at Uber. When they told you Uber was going to replace taxi cabs. No, I don't think anybody looked at them and be like, oh, whoa. Look at Airbnb, the same thing. Um, all these technologies that we have today, I see that there is something to replace them in the future. And the earlier you get in, the better. Most people don't feel comfortable investing in, in those companies because they're still small. Um, a lot of them have concept and they don't have a product yet. Uh -huh, because even like Lucid, when I started investing in Lucid, it was like, this is just a concept. They didn't really have a car. And now they have a car, which makes it a, a lot different. And that's why you can see now people are paying premium to try to get in. Um, but again, you have to put in work. Look, okay, there's a company that I did a video here on the channel too called Metro Mile. Again, this one is one that's disrupting the way we do insurance. So if you have a car, you only pay as you drive. So if your car is sitting there and you're not driving, there's no need for you to pay insurance. If your car is packed throughout the winter, you don't pay insurance for that car. So I like that kind of a concept. They pay as you go insurance because uh, for people that don't drive a ton, that would that's a huge market for them so if you can get into that space that would be excellent so again that is the idea on how you can really grow your account faster uh, as far as investing again guys i'm gonna say this this is not trading this is investing so you're buying you're holding you're waiting two three four five years we can see that explosion uh look at people that invested in tesla back in the days if you invested in tesla now you're, you're ripping the rewards because tesla has finally come to fruition and so if you want that same return you should be ready to wait and be patient with it uh, and again you go in low the downside is you can lose a very small amount of money the upside is you can 10 or 20 or sometimes even 30x your investment. So that is my investing strategy. Again, I still have some blue chips in my account, which is obvious. So the ones that pay dividends and stuff like that, I like that. And I know I haven't talked about dividends here on the channel a lot because um, I think that's pretty obvious. Um, I don't need to be singing the, the song all, all the time. So instead, I'm giving you disruptive uh companies that I see potential and sometimes I would look at companies when the price drops I would tell you guys to get in like uh, we looked at cassava sciences here I'm like whoa whoa this thing went from like 130 bucks down to 42 bucks because of some bad news if this news reverses this thing's gonna go up but if it, the news doesn't it'll go down but you can put the stop loss so your chances of getting in and taking uh, taking uh, taking a chance there it's good because if you want to go if it starts going down it's, it you know kicks you out but if it goes up it goes up so and you saw what happened because ever since it just exploded so again those are some of the, uh, the the ways that i used to invest or or to grow my account um over the years so and i do this with all my investment accounts so i have uh, a roth ira i have a traditional ira i have a 401k i have an individual investment account and so then my wife has um, the same thing. We have an HSA account. So all those accounts, I'm like putting things in different positions, different companies, different industries in different accounts. That way I have a balance. So if I take overall the holistic account, um, I'm covered in the different industries that you can potentially see out there. So that's my strategy. I hope this was helpful. Again, if you guys want me to kind of share stuff like this, I can share with you. I have a list of other companies that I'm researching. Um, I'm going to do a better job at the really start putting this list out there before I even start doing individual videos on each of the, the stocks. So I'll, I'll try my best um, to do that. It's it's not easy because you spend so much time researching that you don't even have time to do videos. By the time I get to do videos, like, like oh, my brain is like fried because I'm like focusing more on researching. Um, last one, look at um, lithium recycling. 
companies because right now nobody's thinking about it all you're thinking about cars 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 these cars are going to break down five ten years from now and when they break down they're not just going to take that lithium and dump it in the trash they have to recycle it so companies that are recycling lithium would come in handy i'm talking like life cycle that's in that what's one company there's redwood material which i'm still waiting for them the minute they, they actually announced they're going public i'm jumping on board on that one it's not a public traded company yet but see I'm watching them already, even before. So, like, if you look at um, a company like Arriver, it was the same thing. I started watching Arriver. I was like, huh, you guys are going to go public here pretty soon. So, I'm going to be watching you. Um, Arriver is one of the largest um, electric car manufacturer in the UK. Um, so, I started watching them. When they said they were going public, bam, I, I jumped right on board. So, that's, that's how you have to stay on top of this. If your goal is to grow your investment account, you're gonna to have to put in the work because what I've seen is yes, you would hear from Wall Street people like just put it in a good blue chip account and let it sit there and then you retire at 67. Um, so it sits there for 40, 50, 60 years or well, how long you worked and then you retire at 67 with some money and a little money in your bank account. That approach doesn't work anymore. Again, if you feel like you wanna work until like you're 70 years old, then that approach might work for you. But if you don't want to, then you're going to have to change the way you're investing because your account can grow faster. But again, it takes work managing it, understanding and buying the right companies and hoping for that growth. So that would that's it for this video. Again, let me know if you guys enjoy videos like this. I'm going to continue to make uh, more of them, just sharing with you guys uh, some of the tricks in, in, that I use in growing my accounts uh, as far as investing goes. If you're new here, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. If that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on your content. Also, guys, if you're looking to get started with investing, Weibo has your promotion where if you sign up and deposit $5, you get free stocks, free Shiba tokens. Um, just, yeah, sign up. They'll give you that. No cost to you. Links in the description. And as always, guys, do your due diligence. Don't be a greedy savage. Stay motivated.